Hello again and welcome to Banks Line Jewellers. Uh, I've been missing for a little while. I've been trying to catch up on all the new brands and all the new variation of models which we bought when we went to the Balfour this year in Switzerland. Now what I'd like to show you today is part of the new collection which is arriving from Amiga and notably the two limited edition pieces which we have managed to obtain which are known as the Bullhead and these particular models were first brought out back in 1969 uh, at that period they were actually manual wind watches where today we're using the modern coaxial movements automatic with a 52 hour power reserve uh, the coaxial movement as you may know is an in-house movement made by Amiga now the the beauty of these particular watches that I love particularly being chronographs when they were first introduced if you look at the position on the wrist it was ideal if you were timing a race or timing a lap whereby you could press stop start and then you could handle it quite easy as you were driving that's one of the beauties of this particular one you then have a, an inner bezel on this particular one which can move either way so you can set it for between 1 and 12 hours whichever the lap time you want to record now the glass itself is sapphire crystal and it also has an anti-reflective uh, coating both on the outside as well as on the inside I particularly like this case it's a it's a solid block of stainless steel and then it's been machined so that we have the screw on case back with the typical Seamaster logo that Amiga put on and as you can see it states bullhead limited edition on each particular range there are only 669 of this limited edition uh, in each model available I particularly like the the red uh, stitching on this strap. The strap feels almost like a rubber strap so it's obviously more water resistant than uh, a lot of the normal leather straps that you would get. Even to the detail of the crown we have the Amiga symbol set into the crown which is quite nice. If you unscrew and pull out to the first position you have a rapid date change as you can see the date changing like so and when the watch is, button is pulled out you stop the watch to, enabling you to set it precisely now the chronograph is set like so you don't see chronographs in this design they are conventionally they have the buttons either side of the of the crown on this side so the the bull head gives not only the tradition and the the vintage feel and look about it but because of the uh, the weight of the watch although it doesn't look excessive when it's on the on the wrist i think it's a, a rather attractive talking piece as well and also functional the solid case that they've produced they've managed to not only satinize the actual case all round but they've put a little bit of a, a chamfer polished chamfer which just picks out that uh, lovely sort of finish matte finish that they have so that's the new edition of the bullhead and uh, this is the black version as you can see from the master catalog is here we also have the white version the reason why we chose these two is that this particular one has the facility to show you a 24 hour clock as well by reading off whether it be 7 19 etc and again that will move either way whichever way you want to uh, set that particular scale uh, the white dial is very clear 
I do like this uh, blue and black inner dial which um, is operated from the 6 o'clock button and again you have the stop start facility of 1 and then 0 which is very positive. This will be a, a column wheel design this uh, which is quite new uh, for the modern watchmaking industry particularly Amiga have introduced this quite a lot. Uh, the strap on this particular model uh, is a leather strap, brown leather uh, stitched. Both of them have rather a nice deployant uh, buckle which are very easy to set up and adjust to your wrist size. Two push buttons to release it and then if you were to extend it you can just simply push that in, shape the strap a little bit like so, till it sits neatly and then it's adjusted to your wrist size. So the two prize models again 669 of these models in a limited edition. So these are new addition to us from uh, the Balfour this year which Amiga have uh, produced. Something very different, very much a talking point and keeps in touch with the, the vintage period watches which Amiga are notable for. We have available interest free finance if you wish. Uh, we generally look for somewhere in the region of 20% deposit and it can be done over 12, 24 or 36 months. So that's available if you go back to our, our website. Anyway, once again it's been very nice speaking to you and um, goodbye for now.